Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we'll look at the science behind intermittent fasting. But before we go into the science, let's get one thing straight. There is no one way to practice intermittent fasting. If you Google it, you'll get a list of possibilities, each with their own proponents. All intermittent fasting strategies are largely founded on the same idea. When you limit your caloric intake, your body will burn stored fat for energy. Intermittent fasting has been shown to have a number of health benefits, including weight loss, improved insulin sensitivity, and reduced risk of chronic diseases. It also has a number of effects on hormones, metabolism, and cellular repair. Talking about hormone intermittent fasting has revealed increased levels of human growth hormone, HGH. HGH is a hormone that helps to build muscle and burn fat. Intermittent fasting has been shown to increase HGH levels, which can help with weight loss and body composition. Increased levels of norepinephrine. Norepinephrine is a hormone that helps to increase metabolism and fat burning. Intermittent fasting has been shown to increase norepinephrine levels, which can help with weight loss. Reduced levels of cortisol. Cortisol is a hormone that is released in response to stress. High levels of cortisol can lead to weight gain and other health problems. Intermittent fasting has been shown to reduce cortisol levels, which can help with weight loss and overall health. Intermittent fasting has also been shown to have a wide range of metabolic benefits, such as an increase in fat burning, which results in weight loss, or an increase in insulin, which can lessen the risk of type 2 diabetes. Regardless, there has been an increase in ketones production. Ketones are a type of fuel that the body can use when it is in a fasted state. Intermittent fasting can help to increase the production of ketone bodies, which can provide energy for the brain and other organs. Intermittent fasting also have a number of effects on cellular repair, including increased autophagy. Autophagy is a process by which the body breaks down and recycles damaged cells. Intermittent fasting can help to increase autophagy, which can help to improve cell function and reduce the risk of diseases. Increased production of new cells. Intermittent fasting can help to increase the production of new cells, which can help to repair damage and improve overall health. Reduced inflammation. Inflammation is a chronic condition that can damage cells and tissues. Intermittent fasting can help to reduce inflammation, which can improve overall health. Overall, there is a lot of potential and science behind intermittent fasting, and there is still a lot of research being done today. However, we will conclude our video here, and if you enjoy our work, please check out our other videos on intermittent fasting. Also, kindly share, like, and subscribe.